Islam transcends race, language, and geography. The Quran has a universal message for all humanity. Even though it was revealed in Arabic and to an Arab, this does not attribute any holiness to the Arabs. Superiority in Islam, as the Quran states, is based solely on taqwa. The most honorable of you in the sight of Allah is the most righteous. Insulting Arabs or any ethnic group is a grave sin, but it is not tantamount to blasphemy. While blasphemy involves denying or ridiculing the basic tenets of the faith, ethnic insults violate the principles of justice and compassion that Islam upholds. The Quran criticizes the Arab arrogance of boasting about their ancestry, emphasizing that the most important thing is faith and righteous deeds. Even prominent figures such as Hazrat Umar recognize that being an Arab does not confer religious privilege. Islam teaches us to treat everyone with respect, regardless of their background. Therefore, the idea that the revelation of the Quran in Arabia gives Arabs superiority is fundamentally flawed. True honor lies in our consciousness of God and in our actions. In conclusion, it has been stated in a 100% ethnically correct way and the Arabs, the Israelis, or the Greeks are the people in the geography and they are unique but not superior to each other.